G'day, today we're going to look at how to work out the area of a rectangle. That is the two-dimensional space inside a shape that looks like this. So let's have a look at an example, this one right here. So here we have a rectangle with a length of 5 metres and a width of 3 metres. Now we measure area in units such as square metres, okay, where we have 1 metre by 1 metre sides and it gives us an area within that of 1 metre squared. So for a 5 metre by 3 metre rectangle, the way we work this out is pretty simple. We're just going to follow this basic formula where area is equal to the length times the width. And we're going to see how many of these square metres are within it. So let's do that. So first off, we have a length of 5 metres. Okay, and I can mark these in, okay? So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 of these. And this is multiplied by 3 metres, the width of 3 metres. So we have 1, 2, 3, okay? And as you can see, you can count these number of square metres within this. This is equal to 15 metres squared. It's pretty simple, right? You want to work out the area of a rectangle, just multiply the length by the width. There's just one thing to watch out for. I'll show you in this example right here. So we have a rectangle here which is 3 centimetres wide and 40 millimetres long. Now as you might notice, the units here differ from each other. For the 40, we have millimetres and we have 3 which is in centimetres. So before we work out this rectangle's area, we need to make both of these measurements into the same units. So what we're going to do is we're going to convert this 40 millimetres here into its centimetre equivalent value. That is 40 millimetres is equal to 4 centimetres. Now we can go through and work out the area, but this time it's going to be in square centimetres. Okay, so what do we have? We have the area is equal to the length times the width, which is equal to, well, the length is 4 centimetres and the width is 3 centimetres. So the area is equal to 4 centimetres times 3 centimetres. This is 12 centimetres squared. And we could even draw these in right now. 4 multiplied by 3, and there you go, we have 12 centimetres squared. So it's really important just to watch out for that, that you make the units the same and do it before you work out that area. Anyway, thank you for watching. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe. This is part of a bigger playlist where we're going to be having a look at how to work at area and volume. Check it out in the description. If you wish to support the Tech Math channel, there is a Patreon page, which is also in the description. A big shout out to my patrons. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.